All right, so at this point, I'm sure a lot of you have already heard the big news. And yes, it's, it's true. It's actually happening. The next Dokkan Festival exclusive unit that's going to be dropping on JP after the Broly banner goes away after Saiyan Day is a Dokkan Fest Fidel. And if any of you tell me that you saw this coming, if you tell me that you had predicted this, uh, I would straight up call you a liar, man, because you did not call this. Nobody called this. Nobody saw this coming. But it's happening, guys. And honestly, I'm I'm down for it. I'm totally okay with this. I love Videl as a character. And uh, I think she deserves it for sure. I mean, I, I, I know many people think that this is the April Fool's prank for this year. You know, every single year. Uh, Bandai slash Akatsuki, they pull some kind of prank on us, whether it's like a dating sim from a couple a uh, couple years ago, or the uh, kart racing game, you know, preview from last year. But uh, for all of those pranks, it was always on the day of April Fools, not a couple days in advance, right? And right now it's the 29th, and uh, we still got like three days to go before you know April 1st, April Fools' Day, so. No, this is not a prank. This is actually happening. Videl is the next Dokkan Festival exclusive unit for Dokkan. And uh, I'm sure she's going to be great. I'm sure they're going to make her really, really busted. Just like all of the other Dokkan Fests we've been getting recently. And uh, the more exciting thing, honestly, is that she's probably going to be the first Dokkan Festival exclusive uh, Peppy Gals lead. You know, the first like 170 across the board or 170 to attack and defense, 130 or 150 to uh, HP or something like that. You know, some combination of uh, those numbers. But she will be the first legit, first official Dokkan Fest Peppy Gals lead. And that team is just really awesome now. You know, like there are so many really, really impressive units in the Peppy Gals category. It just needed a proper leader. And now it looks like we're gonna get one. Um, it would be a shame, yo. Honestly, like it, obviously, if it's not like guaranteed, she is gonna be Peppy Gals, but it would be a shame if she wasn't a Peppy Gals lead. So I'm gonna assume she is going to be, and uh, I can't wait for her details. I'm sure the animations will look solid. Um, Videl has some decent moments in the anime for sure that they can make into nice animations. Uh, we'll see. We'll see. Now, that's awesome. Right, Videl's coming. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys think about that. But to me, the more interesting aspect of this upcoming unit, of this announcement, is what it spells for the future of the game, okay? Because the fact we're getting a Dokkan Fest Videl means that Bandai and Akatsuki are really not afraid to go with any character from the entire franchise to make into a Dokkan Festival unit and probably an LR as well, you know, like they're really okay, they're open to going completely outside of the box, and that's awesome, and because we're getting a Videl, which I believe is the first, um, no, not the first, not the, I was gonna say the first female Dokkan Festival exclusive, that's not true though, we did get Kefla, as well as, um, is that it? Is Kefla the only one? Kefla might be the only Dokkan Fest exclusive female unit, but either way, She's one of the first, okay, they're very uncommon. And yo, the fact we're getting Videl to me means that Android 18, Dokkan Fest Android 18 or LR Android 18, a standalone one, not with 17, not with Krillin, not with anybody else, a standalone Dokkan Fest Android 18. It's just a matter of time, man. It's an inevitability at this point, you know? Like, if they're gonna give a Dokkan Fest to Videl, Android 18, in my opinion, is the more popular female character. I could be wrong. You guys might disagree with me. I'm sure there are a lot of uh, Videl fanboys out there. That's cool. That's okay. But I'm just saying, like, in my eyes, Android 18 is the more prominent character. She definitely has more screen time. She's more powerful, right? So, um, you know, just thinking about it right now, man. I'm it's getting me hyped. It's getting me hyped. I've been asking for this for so long. You guys know in the streams, in the comments, every single time somebody asks me, yo, if you could create your own Dokkan Festival unit, 
your own LR, if you just had a choice of like the next summonable unit you could make your own, what would it be? And almost every single time, without fail, I've said, a standalone Android 18. That's what I want. Okay, you can call me a simp if you want to. I mean, at this point, it's pretty clear. Okay, I admit to it. It is what it is. Yo, Dokkan Fest Videl means that Dokkan Fest Android 18 is maybe not around the corner. Maybe not like next month, maybe not in, in six months, even a year, but sometime in the future, I think in the near future, yo, standalone Dokkan Fest Android 18 on the way. Calling it right now, I'm not going to say a specific time or a specific day, but it's happening, guys. And when that day comes, it will be most likely the happiest day of my life, and it will also be the day that your boy goes bankrupt, and that's fine, man. We're pulling out that wallet. We are wailing the F out for a Tokon Fest 18. I promise you, I will rainbow her on that first banner. Okay, so uh, I guess that's all there is to say, man. Dokkan Fest Videl on the way. I'm more excited about the prospect of the 18, as you guys can tell. But um, for now, you know, I'm, I'm looking forward to her animations, her details. Hopefully a very good Peppy Gals lead. Um, if I were to guess, I would say she'll probably give Peppy Gals a nice um, support as well on her passive. I'm sure she's going to hit very hard. I'm sure she's going to have a lot of defense. All those good things you would expect from a unit. So uh, yeah, I'm not disappointed by this. Once again, let me know your opinions in the comments. I know some people are, you know, slightly upset because they're like, oh, Videl, like why... Does she deserve a Dokkan Fest unit? But I think she does, man. I think any prominent um, character, you know, from Dragon Ball deserves a Dokkan Fest eventually. And like, you know, you can only make so many Gokus. You can only make so many Vegetas and Trunkses. So uh, it's nice to see them really, once again, go outside of the box, right? Like kind of take risks, I guess. It's not really a risk, though. There are a really good amount of Videl fans out there, and I think this banner, even though it's not going to do as well as, like, a, you know, Broly banner or a UI Goku banner or whatever, it's going to probably still get a decent amount of people to summon, especially if they do her animations right, especially if her kit is right, and I'm sure it will be. Um, so, yeah, look forward to that. Once the details come out, once we get the Twitter reveal or the data download, whichever comes first, I'll be there to present you guys with the information as well as the, you know, live reactions. And uh, of course, we will be getting something for April Fools, most likely, you know, some kind of a fake reveal for an upcoming mode in the game, like cooking with Chi Chi or something like that, and then a free to play unit along with that too. So uh, yeah, that's coming too. This is not April Fools though, okay, April Fools is in a couple days. They never do the April Fool's reveals this early, so it's got to be real. It's got to be real. I'm calling it right now. Yo, watch it end up being the April Fool's thing, and they just decided to do it extra early because that would be most effective, I guess, right? But I don't see it, guys. No, I don't see it. I think this Videl is real. I really do. And uh, Bandai. Yo, Bandai Spies, if you're watching, give us that Dokkan Fest Android 18 as quickly as possible okay so uh yeah guys that is today's video thank you so much for watching uh, as always if you liked the video then make sure to like the damn video and if it's your first time watching me first time to the channel and you like what you see then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the tiger squad now and while you're at it hit that notification bell too so that youtube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content and that's it I'm out of here. Until next time, hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media, signing out.